Says the Kama Sutra, if your penis is too small for a woman, this group of positions should be used to make sure that you can both get pleasure. So the first position, which is very simple, it says your legs should lie along hers, caressing their whole length from toes to thighs. She should always be to your left. So essentially in this one, you're lying side by side next to each other. And the only thing to remember is that for both of you, your legs have to be absolutely straight and touching each other all the way. So all the way from the thighs to the toes, your legs need to be touching. The second position, if you're feeling a little bit more experimental, the lover's thighs are interlaced and squeeze each other in rhythm. So basically here, now your thighs are interlaced and using your thighs, you squeeze in rhythm. So you squeeze and you let go. You squeeze and you let go. And this actually contracts the vagina and pulses. So it helps to increase the friction a little bit more. And the third one, which is a little bit more complicated, but a lot of fun to try, it says, in this, she crosses her legs or rolls each thigh inwards thus greatly strengthening her grip on your penis. So in this one, your thighs are no longer interlaced. You're now lying next to each other once again. But the woman in this crosses her thighs one over the other. And then she squeezes her thighs so that they turn inwards in pulses, in and out, in and out. And with that, she squeezes further onto your penis. Now, as you can see, all of these positions are really simple. All they're supposed to do is they decrease the size of the vagina slightly, which in turn will increase the friction. And that's what then results in pleasure for both of you. Size is never an obstacle to pleasure. You just need to know what to do. And now that you know what to do, go! Have the best sex of your life.